I'm just going to do my standard makeup today. I feel like so tired. <laughs> Look, these dark circles. When it gets to winter, I just like want to get cozy and go to bed. And I normally just like, I'll be like, I'm going to watch a film or I'm going to watch TV. And I actually just fall asleep through it. So I'm just taking my Elf Mineralized Primer. I'm putting that on my face. Like my besties got engaged like a couple of weeks ago. So I don't know if she'll watch this video, but if she is, congratulations, you know who you are. And excitingly, she has asked me to do her wedding makeup for her. So I mentioned a few videos ago, like I used to do makeup. Um, I've not actually done it on other people for a while. So she's entrusting me with that. Um, but you know, I'll obviously just do a couple of trials and practices on her beforehand. So you always have time to change your mind. <laughs> if you don't like it, I won't be offended. Um, so yeah, that's cool and exciting. Um, so yeah, that was awesome news actually. Yeah, um, we are coming into Halloween week, guys. So this literally used to be my most exciting week of the year. Um, just cause I love, I love Halloween. I used to love fancy dress, I love pumpkins. I don't love eating pumpkins, but I just love pumpkin patches and just, you know, seeing loads of pumpkins around. I've been so lazy this year though, I haven't even carved up a pumpkin. And that's probably the first year I haven't, and I'm probably not going to this year, which is kind of boring of me, but I've been too tired and busy with this new job. I just like literally don't have time, but I am partaking. Oh my God, I just got foundation in my hair. Um, I am partaking in some like fun Halloween festi festivities. So sadly, no, oh my God, there's like doors slamming in this house. Um, like sadly, no trick or treating. Cause I don't think people do that anymore. Cause I think it's too dangerous, which is sad times for these kids, but you know, um, safety comes first. I am, however, so like Halloween is on Wednesday, it's currently Sunday, so, oh by the way, I'm getting ready to go for lunch and dinner, um, getting those winter calories, uh, yeah, so, um, what was I saying? Oh yeah, my Halloween festivity, so I'm not invited to any Halloween parties this year, which is disappointing, but I don't think anyone I know is really having any, because Halloween is midweek, it's on a Wednesday, um, so, in Dead. Well, given I've not been invited to a Halloween party and I'm at work on Wednesday and people, like they did say at work, like people want to come to work in fancy dress, like that's cool, but I have only been there for eight weeks and I do not yet feel comfortable going in fancy dress and also you always worry about that thing that they say that and then like you'll rock up and be the only person there in fancy dress. Um, or like it will just be awful. You know like in Mean Girls when Lindsay Lohan thinks that people actually dress up as scary things for Halloween when <laughs> like the whole joke of that film is actually it's just an excuse to like wear no clothes and some sort of animal ears. Um, it would be like that, like you would rock up in something and everybody else would just be like in their normal work clothes with some like cat ears or something and you're dressed like a zombie bride. So yeah, not risking that. Plus I think I have, meetings with like external people and I'm pretty sure I'm not supposed to go to those in fancy dress. So I'm back with brows and I am taking this Benefit Eye Bright pencil and just putting that on my inner corners because that makes you look more awake. It's like an inner corner highlight really but sometimes I'll do like an inner corner highlight on top of this as well because this is like very natural like every day. Um, so yeah, I'm not gonna do like a vampy look today, um, but I do wanna do one of those like on this channel pretty soon, because it is winter and that is, I've mentioned, you know, on numerous occasions, but because it's quite a cash occasion today, I don't feel like doing, you know, like dark eyes and dark lips or whatever. So I am instead, I've been doing like quite a kind of bright glowy winter look recently when I want to look more natural. So I'm taking this eyeshadow here, which is like a kind of beigey grey, um, and I'm just going to put that on my lids. Um, so I think the vibe is, I'm really sorry if you can hear door slamming by the way, like I apologise, <laughs> but there's nothing I could do about it. Um, yeah, so I think the vibe is, do you guys remember that song that JLo sang and 
it was a wintry song and she's wearing like some sort of eskimo -y jacket with a hood i think it's called all i have or something um and it's with i think it's with ll cool j it's from like the 2000s anyway she did this like super glowy winter makeup look and there was no vampiness or like you know dark lips or anything inside it was all very very you know typical j-lo glow um but proper winter vibes so that's the vibe we're going for today um i feel like i need to take some brown and blend that into the eyeshadow a bit because this is a bit more glowy than i was actually expecting or going for so i'm just going to go for a very neutral brown like this one here and just blend that on the outer portion of the eye ideally you wouldn't really do this after eyeliner so just be careful I mean I'm trying to be careful and that just blends it a bit and I'm just lightly patting that okay that's a bit better that subdued it a little bit can you tell I'm tired <laughs> I'm taking my Rimmel Cole pencil and I'm doing my uh, I think I might do kind of slightly waterline today. The issue I have as a contact lens wearer is if I do waterline eyeliner, and that's why I do very little of it, um, it just starts seeping into my contact onto my contact lens and then I just can't really see very well. Because um, you have this like black smudge over your eyeball and it's really hard to get off. And I'm taking my Maybelline Falsies and just doing some mascara so guys it is like proper sweater weather and I really wanted to do the sweater weather tag for my next video um anyone that used to watch old school YouTube will know what that is I don't think that tag has been done in about like seven years so I just felt the need to maybe bring it back I'm doing for time because obviously I am going out I'm not doing well for time. Crap. Oh no, the clocks went back, yes, back, back yesterday for British save, British daylight savings. So I actually might be doing work time. A bronzer, which is the Rimmel Natural Bronzer um, in the color Sun Glow. And mm, I'm starting to feel like this is maybe a little bit too dark for me because I'm, I didn't get much of a tan in the summer. Well, I got a little bit, and the other day, I do my makeup in the morning before work when it's like really early and quite dark, so I'm not in natural light. And I got to work the other day, and I was like, "Whoa, I think I slightly overdid this stuff." <laughs> but I mean, whatever. No one said anything, so. And you know, some people have the mantra that you can never wear too much bronzer, so. Again, it's fine. I mean, I'm doing it a bit more lightly today. Did you see that? I dotted it on. So, yeah. So I'm taking my Revlon Photo Ready uh, Cream Blusher in Flushed because this is just my favourite. To be honest, it's just so easy to apply and it like is really natural when it's on. And you can build it up or you can have it really lightly. And that's why I use this one pretty much every time. Um, I will probably start mixing up the makeup products a bit though because. I do switch them up a bit in the winter but today because I don't really want to test anything new I'm just going for you know the good old faves um what did I just do so I've done bronzer blusher just a bit of highlighter so I'm taking my Fenty girl next door and chic freak and I might actually do chic freak today because I normally use girl next door which is this this like paler more subdued one so I might use chic freak today because everything else is kind of Karma on my face, um, it's in Karma C A L M E R <laughs> instead of Karma because that doesn't make any sense. Oh my god, I guys, I just don't know what I'm talking about today. Oh gosh, Chic Freak is definitely more potent than Girl Next Door, but we like it. We're going for the J Lo glow, so let's just let's just pile it all on. So I'm switching to the fan brush, that was the highlighter brush. Uh, just because the fan brush is easier for, you know, the other bits on your face that you'd highlight. But you know the, the top part of your cheekbone, I find the fan brush doesn't 
really cover it to the extent I'd want it to. Um, so yeah, are we looking glowy today? Let's hope. So I'm taking my Vaseline Rosy Lips, which is just the best one because it's just, I don't know, it tastes nice. Uh, my lips have been so dry in the winter, so actually, like, I use this as, a, you know, a primer kind of thing for my lip products. Uh, but on the daily, I've been using this, like, I think it's by Carmex, and it's a medicated lip salve, because uh, my lips just get dry and gross in the winter. So, also in time for Halloween, I saw that on Netflix they have rebooted Sabrina the Teenage Witch, which was my all-time favourite show when I was a child, and it had Melissa Joan Hart in it, and it was about this witch, and it was just awesome. So it's been, obviously like they're remaking everything at the moment, like, um, it's a thing. Like clearly everyone's run out of ideas, it's like nothing new to do, so they realise that a whole bunch of kids won't have seen these films from like the 90s and 2000s, so they're just remaking everything, so like all these films and all these TV shows. So yeah, they've rebooted Sabrina but they've made it dark and it's called The Chilling Tales of Sabrina I think. So I saw a trailer for it and I think it was it debuted on the 26th of October but they've got all 10 episodes of the first season on there. So I think I'm gonna have to check it out but it might offend me. It's always creepy when you leave a camera on and go out of the room because if you've ever watched, you know, those paranormal activity movies, like, I try not to do that, but sometimes I'm just lazy. Um, so I'm taking soft spoken and finally doing my lips. Uh, so another thing I was going to mention on the whole film and TV sitch, you guys watch that uh, channel on uh, like Sky or, or whatever. Um, called The Vault because I think it's on Freeview as well but it is amazing because it's got like if you're a 90s child it's got Keenan and Kel, uh, Sabrina, Sister Sister like it just shows all of these shows that I used to love from my childhood when they used to all come on Nickelodeon. I watched three back-to-back -back episodes of Keenan and Kel because that's one that I haven't actually watched on there um, and I literally haven't watched it since it was originally on TV, probably. And, oh my god, like, given <laughs> that was a while ago, I literally still found it hilarious. Like, clearly, my humour has not matured, because I was crying. Tears streaming down my face. I haven't laughed that much at a film or TV show in so long. Like, it's so good. You need to check it out. Just watch it. It's, like, as good as it was back in the day. Uh, yeah. So, I think my makeup's done. I don't think I need anything else. So yeah, this is like a glowy winter look. Normally I put lip gloss on top of my liquid lipstick, but I might just leave it matte today. So don't do that usually. So yeah, uh, that was a quick get ready with me. Um, I hope you guys are enjoying autumn, enjoy Halloween week, and hopefully next time I'm gonna have a video up which will be the sweater weather tag, so watch this space. Thank you for watching.